Good morning, LGN. Today is Friday, January 6th, 2023. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart and face the flag. One, two, three. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, friends, where this this week, I don't know about you, but this week felt like it flew by. I know it was a short week, four days, and sometimes those weeks seem to take forever. But this week really, I don't know, it just, it went quickly for me. I hope it did for you as well. Maybe if you love being here, maybe I hope it didn't go as quickly for you, right? <laughs> um, lots of fun things. Yesterday I had a few visitors to my office and uh, they wanted to share a few things. And I was really impressed. My friend Layla Foley, uh, she brought this picture for me. Now, this is me and Layla. And she wrote the entire alphabet. And then she recited it for me. She looked, she pointed to each letter and she said every letter of the alphabet, all 26 letters. Just so impressed with Layla. Nice job. Super proud of you. Keep practicing those letters, all of my kindergarten friends. My friend Chloe came to visit me and is just so proud of her writing. This was the picture of the day yesterday. It's a, a zebra. Look at that zebra, right? I'd love to share Chloe's writing. She was so proud of it and she loves to write, which I love to hear. It says, hi, my name is Piggy. I don't know why my mom named me Piggy. Maybe she thinks I'm going to grow up to be a pig. That would be so silly. If I was a pig, it would be so hard to balance on the tightrope. <laughs> she did a great job using those key words from the word bag too, didn't she? So nice job, Chloe, super proud of you. Got a great picture of Chloe and her writing. I also had a visitor, my friend Nolan came by. He sent this to me the other day. I haven't had a chance to show it yet, but it's a beautiful snow cone. And I don't know if you can see, it says, let it snow cone. <laughs> <laughs> but Nolan, uh, in honor of National Bird Day, brought one of his new favorite books that he got over the holidays uh, about birds of prey. It was a graphic novel. It was really cool. So uh, he shared that. We talked about some of, uh, of the bird facts that we know. I also got this beautiful picture from my friend Ella Bissett, and just a great note on it. Look at that beautiful beach scene. There I am. I think I'm trying to get some coconuts out of the tree there. Ella seems to be chilling on the beach, but... The message is my favorite. She wrote, be positive, be happy, be loved. How cool is that? So thank you, Ella, for that picture. Love it. And don't want to forget about birthdays today. Let's see. Today's the 6th. So we have no January birthdays, but we do have a July birthday. A very happy birthday today to Scarlett Hayes. Hope you celebrate in a fun way. Don't forget to get your birthday book at lunch. A couple of other things today happens to be Cuddle Up Day. I know Miss Carlson's class is doing Comfy Cozy Day, perfect day for that. Uh, it's also National Technology Day. I don't know where we, we would be without technology. I wouldn't be able to do these announcements, I know that. It's also National Bean Day. I know Miss Klinger's class has a joke about beans. I'm not sure exactly what the joke is, but I know my friend Derek and I joke about eating beans. Uh, beans are actually really healthy for you. Yeah, great source of fiber and protein. Um, and they've been around for thousands and thousands of years. So maybe celebrate with some beans tonight. I don't know. Um, I did realize that I forgot some jokes yesterday. Gigi and, and Joy, even Grogu, were saying, you didn't do any jokes, Mr. Higgins. So I have two good ones for you. This first one, what do you call a fish with two knees? A toonie fish. <laughs> That's a good one. Why do you never see elephants hiding in trees? Because they're so good at it. <laughs> Love those jokes. Hope you did too. Have a wonderful Friday, a great weekend. Uh, do lots of learning today. And don't forget, Mr. Higgins loves you. Bye.